morning, good morning, good morning, you two. How y'all doing out there? Um, somebody wrote me, asked me to make this video about inbreeding and line breeding. All right, inbreeding. Inbreeding, people think um, son to mother, father to um, daughter, that's um, brother and sister. That's called, they say that is um, inbreeding. I say um, brother to sister, it can say it's inbreeding. But, um, son to mother and father to daughter that's line breeding in my opinion you know it's my opinion but um people don't understand you do gotta do a little bit of inbreeding and you do gotta do a little bit of line breeding to make your dogs pure you got to the American Pit Bull Terry is one of the purest dogs in the world because they've been line breeding and inbreeding like crazy. The real American Pit Bull Terrier, the Bruce Lee type of dog. No, that's a real pit bull. Bruce Lee body. You know what you know how Bruce Lee was? Slim, tight. <laughs> that nigga was the illest, man. Rest in peace, Bruce Lee. You would never, yo, you would still be in my mouth because you was the greatest. But, yo, um, now, line breeding. They said, this is what, you know, I did my research on and I've been doing my research about it. But, yo, this is what they saying. They saying, um, grand son to grandmother grandfather to granddaughter that's what they call line breeding but um I say the same thing but you know I say that um son to mother and um father to daughter is line breeding but you got I say 20% people saying there's no. You got 20% people saying yes. You know? But y'all be the judge of that. I want to know your opinions about that. What y'all think about um, inbreeding and line breeding. What do y'all think about that inbreeding and line breeding? Tell me about it in the prescription stuff like that. And I'm gonna have you know, I'm gonna pull up something online about inbreeding and line breeding and put in a prescription, you know, box. And you know, talk about that. We're gonna talk about this line breeding and inbreeding. And is it necessary in the um, when you start in a breed, when you're trying to make a breed, when you're trying to do anything as breeding dogs? I say yes. You do. You got to line breed and you got to inbreed to make the dogs pure. No matter what. You got to line breed and inbreed to make the dogs pure. You got to. It's like a must. I don't care what people say. You can't take um, a staff and breed it to a pit and just say that's a pit. You can't, because it's not the truth. And people think the staff and the pit is the same. But um, I don't care what people say. Where the staff comes from, the American Staffordshire Terrier. It comes from pit and Staffordshire Bull Terrier. Somebody bred a pit to a Staffordshire Bull Terrier to get the American Staffordshire Terrier. And that's real. I don't care what you said. I called up some England people in England. And that's how the American Staffordshire Terrier started. And I called up this guy. 
that been breeding American stab since 1930. 1930. And that's how he started his dogs. With Pit, American Pit Bull Terrier, the real American Pit Bull, like G, Red Boy Jocko, Turtle Buster, Nigarino. To a Staffy Bull. And a Staffy Bull is a short type of dog from England. It's really called Staff. It's called it's called England. It's really called the English Staffy Bull. Man took that and bred that to American Pit Bull Terrier to get hit American Bully. I mean, oh, sorry, not American. Fuck, I'm talking about. Fuck that dumb shit. <laughs> American Staffordshire Terrier. That's what he took to get that. And, you know, he line bred an inbreed to make his American Staffordshire Terrier. And he'd been breeding since 1930. I'm not going to give him any names and nothing, but I talked to the man, older man, OG, like me, I'm an OG, but he's a triple OG in his breeding since 1930. Triple OG, like my grandfather, triple OG, like my father, rest in peace, them two, they triple OGs, yes. But, yo, um, you got to line breed and inbreed to make the dogs pure, no matter what. I don't care what you say, I don't care what you think, you got to. You got to line breed and inbreed to make the dogs pure. And yo, that's my video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for people for looking at my videos, subscribing. I ain't make a video in a while because I've been working three jobs, <laughs> two, you know, major two jobs, and then coming home dealing with my my dogs. You know, but um, I'm here. We still here. www.oldbulldogs.com www.dogkennelsnyc.com 347-231-8242 New York office I got a Long Island office but I don't know it by heart right now um, I got South Carolina number South Carolina office 843-688-5098 and um, my factory is closed to the public because there's grimy people in this world. Grimy people. Grimy people. They lie, do wrong, and they will do stupid stuff. But, yo, we ship dogs all over the country. And if you're in New York, we bring you the dog. If you're in South Carolina, if you're in Long Island, we bring you the dog. Because we want, we take pride in knowing where our dogs be. We take pride in knowing where our dogs be. For now on and since. But thank you. Call us and have a nice day. To my haters, punch y'all niggas in your face. Punch y'all niggas in your lip. No, punch your own self in the face and punch your own self in the lip for hating of the truth that I give people. I give knowledge to people about breeding dogs. I don't lie. I don't bull crap. I don't bull crap people. Have a nice day, people. God bless. Mucho corazón. Deuces. And I'm a Latino, black Hispanic. Thank you. Have a nice day.